And it tells you a lot about Barack Obama, that of all places to hold a town hall meeting in Florida, he chose B'nai Torah here in Boca Raton. Okay, I'm out here to create an awareness. I would like once again a reaffirmation by Senator Obama of his support for the state of Israel. And what I found is that Barack Obama is 100% with the state of Israel. He has always been pro-Israel. He is pro-Israel, period. And I'll tell you something, and I believe this. Israel is not uh, entitled to a U.S. congressman, obviously. But if Israel had a U.S. congressman, there is no question in my mind that her choice would be Robert Wexler. I'm Robert Wexler. I have the privilege of representing you in the United States Congress. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, the issue that is so close to my heart and to yours is the issue and the relationship between the United States and Israel. I support Senator Obama for President of the United States because Senator Obama has an A-plus record on support for Israel. A-plus. With the greatest amount of honor, I give you the next president of the United States, Senator Barack Obama. You, nobody can find any statement that I have ever made that is anything less than unequivocally pro-Israel. The greatest threat to Israel today obviously comes from Iraq. That there, a radical regime continues to pursue the ability to build a nuclear weapon and continues to support terrorism across the region. The threat of Iran is real and is great, and my goal as president will be to eliminate it. We will be in a stronger position to achieve tough international sanctions if the United States shows that we are willing to come to the table. I think that the way we're going to reduce Iranian influence is to strengthen our legitimacy and improve our alliances throughout the region, and the Iraqi war actually is impeding us from doing that, we will be in a stronger position to isolate Iran. The time has come for tough, principled, and direct diplomacy to lay out our clear terms. Uh, but this is a town hall meeting, and I know that your interests extend beyond uh, the issue of Israel. So what I'd like to do is just uh, very briefly say that Part of what we're fighting for in this country, domestically, is also uh, to restore a sense of justice. So my question is, please clean up health care. And in general, <laughs> just, I, I'm, I'm losing my house. So I have a, a mother with Alzheimer's. I would just like to see common sense come back to government. You seem like the kind of person... You seem like the kind of person that has common sense. All right. Uh, young lady right there. A vote for Barack Obama is a vote for America and Israel. You know, if, if I'm not honest, if I'm not truthful, vote for me for that reason. But don't vote against me because of who I am. And I know you won't. That's why I believe we're going to win Florida. That's why I believe we're going to change this country. Thank you very much, everybody. God bless you.